I'm Amira David with your 7 Action News headlines. Michigan is seeing a new record for COVID-19 hospitalizations as the state's fourth surge intensifies. Monday, the state reported 4,580 adult hospitalizations. That's 62 more than the previous record, which was set on December 13th. The majority of those hospitalizations, nearly 2,700, are in Metro Detroit. Oxford High School students began a gradual return to class for the first time since the mass shooting at their school on November 30th. The students are rotating between in-person and virtual schedules. Experts say interaction is important for the healing process. In-person learning will take place at Oxford Middle School until the high school reopens on January 24th. A family is pleading for your help to find a missing teen they fear may be held against her will. 17-year-old Zion Foster was last seen in East Point a week ago. That night, relatives say she sent a text message stating she was on her way back home but never made it. Zion's last cell phone tracking location was in Detroit near Greenfield and James Cousins Freeway off of Vassar. She was last seen wearing her Detroit Wing Company uniform. If you've seen her or have any information, call East Point Police. And a quick check on the forecast. Meteorologist Mike Taylor is tracking some bitter cold temps. Mike. Yes, that's right, Amira. Looking at the temperatures with the wind chills over the next 36 hours, uh, not much progress here. We're going to stay sub-zero for the rest of tonight into tomorrow morning, and then we'll slowly and steady recover from that as we get into tomorrow night. But even then, we're talking about some snow in the forecast.